in the last lesson we uh, set up a route to get the post image right so in this lesson we're going to display the image on each post okay but some of the posts they don't have image so we need to show the default image okay so let me quickly search for image beautiful image let's go to pixabay and images from here you can use them for free okay the royalty free stock photos okay so let me search for Annapurna mountains okay and let me go here and I just loved I was looking for mountains but this just uh, is breathtaking okay so the greenery and the river so this image let's use this image okay so let's right click save image as let's go to our project node API and react front let's go to source images and let's call it default in fact let's call it port mountain mountains.jpg okay so let me close this now and come back to my react project okay and I'm here on the post component so previously I commented this out I'm going to use this now I'm going to call it um, default post okay default post from images mountains.jpg okay and I can come all the way down here so we are rendering our post here post title and post body and so on so just before the title I'm going to have the image here okay so image the source is going to be uh, it's going to be let's use backticks let's embed process.env. React underscore app underscore API underscore URL okay slash post slash photo slash we need to send the photo ID so that's going to be post ID sorry not photo ID post ID okay so this is the URL domain slash post slash photo slash post id okay and alt we can give the post name post name in fact post title okay that's alt and what if we don't get the the image right not all the post will have this image so that in that case we're going to use the default uh, default photo right default post so on error we're going to use this our function image target source we give the source using the back ticks this time we can to use default post okay then we can apply some class as well so class let's give image thumbnail Okay. and let's have a bit of a margin underneath so there's a bit of a padding on the title and the image okay so that's the class name what else we can we can apply some custom styling as well okay so height we don't want it to be too big so let's say 200 pixel and width auto okay so this is our image here okay we try to get from there for its post if not we try to load the default post okay so come here and as you can see we already have the post with the proper image okay so that's cool but the ones that don't have they will have this beautiful mountain with river okay so that's awesome okay so this is looking pretty good i would say okay so this is cool now obviously we can do more and more stuff right <laughs> we're not going to wait so let me see you in the next lesson all right